New at 5, surveillance video now out gives us a better idea of what happened when a Colorado sheriff got into a bar fight. The Arapahoe County Sheriff is not pay facing any penalties for it. Video shows Sheriff Tyler Brown pushing another man. He's the man in gray, by the way, across the floor of the bar and briefly grabs him by the throat. Then someone up comes up and punches the sheriff. CBS 4's Rick Salinger obtained that video today. He's been looking at it. Rick? Well, and this happened back on August 21st here at this very large combination bowling alley and bar in Greenwood Village. The police department investigated and they determined that uh, the sheriff had been indeed involved in this action. We obtained the surveillance video from them. Two groups of people are gathered in one spot when the confrontation begins. Sheriff Tyler Brown is wearing a gray short sleeve shirt. He pushes a man away who he said he was escorting to the door. They end up against a table, then into a chair. Then suddenly another man comes up and sucker punches the sheriff from the side. This while another man comes over and gets in between the parties. They end up in a wrestling match on the floor. In an affidavit, the manager of the bar said the sheriff told him he was going to shut down the bar tomorrow and get his liquor license. He did say he believed the words were spoken in anger at the time. The sheriff indicated in an interview with police that he had five or six drinks before the incident. He claimed he did not identify himself as sheriff. In the follow-up investigation, he was quoted as saying, you guys are looking at me pretty hard, so you know this could be the end of my career. He said it started when a man on a dare asked his wife for her phone number. The sheriff said they were happily married. Things went downhill from there, with the melee being captured on several different cameras. The Greenwood Village Police Department's investigation was forwarded to the Denver DA, which looked at it and decided no charges should be filed. They said, however, Sheriff Brown in the situation was irresponsible and unprofessional for an elected sheriff. Live in Greenwood Village, Rick Salinger covering Colorado First.